All right, everybody, Vincent's Indiana at the museum here, and uh, this gentleman has been more than patient here because we tried this four times. This is our fourth time trying to record this uh, piece of history right here. That's uh, the paranormal aspect of this particular piece out of Vincent's Indiana at the museum. This gentleman has been very kind to go through this thing four times with me now to re-explain the history. So if this, this it will be the final time. If this doesn't uh, do the trick here, this doesn't do the trick, this will be the final video. All right, uh, the owner was painting uh, at one particular time. Uh, he was painting in the, in the back room at night and heard something drop. It sounded like a tool drop. So he, knowing he was alone, he went into the other room and Fritz here had just a little bit of a glow about him. And yes. I might say that we, mixed, we named him Fritz. That's his nickname. He's a World War I statue. And we know he's World War I by the shape of the helmet. Yes. He's a little different than World War II. We think he was a guard at a, a, either a monument or a cemetery that had something attached to his base. If he was a monument at a cemetery, that would explain some of the paranormal uh, aspect of the, yeah. that particular piece. And here, in, in, since he's been in this building, he has locked two doors on me and broken one of these glass, these glass doors on my head. Yes. And I was kneeling in front of the case and saw the door bulge until it broke. And since then, when I go past him, I pat him on the shoulder, I talk to him, I made him a friend, and he leaves me alone. And now if he's done the activity or not, he get, he's getting the blame for he's it. Getting the blame. This is from World War One. It could have been a statue at a cemetery. Yeah, it could have been a, it's just a tribute to one of the soldiers, right? Yes. Could that been. served on the German uh, yeah. could have been war. Represent an individual soldier. Could yeah. Could have been a monument at a cemetery yeah. to uh, uh, yes. for the loss of the soldiers at the yeah. Civil War. I'm not Civil War. Apologize. Yeah. Uh, World War One. For the German uh, army. We just we don't know. Yeah, and you said he was glowing. Uh, the owner said he had a glow to him, huh? Yeah. So he was, uh, he was illuminating him. himself, <laughs> huh? Yeah. Yeah, that's that's nuts. Yeah. yeah. But I appreciate the history of that particular piece uh, when it comes to the war and yeah. when it comes to some of the paranormal activity you experienced in here. I appreciate your time today. He's one of my favorites. It's one of your favorite pieces yeah. in here. Yeah, he, I can see why. He just. <laughs> There's something about this yep. piece that stands out, is it not? Yes. That is one awesome piece. Now let's see if he uh, let us record this time because the first three times he wouldn't let us record. Let's see if he's uh, let us record this time. Appreciate your time today on this. Yes.